Matter is anything that occupies space and has mass. Okay, anything that you can see, you can touch, that's matter, including the solids, liquids, or gas, your computers, your monitors, your tables, yourself. Uh, all these are made out of matter, sir. Huh? Uh, but tell me anything that you know which is not matter. Light, okay, light, uh, yes. Sound, okay. Uh, energy are not matter. Okay, good. Particle theories of matter. Let's see what is stated in these uh, particle theories of matter. Now, the particle theories of matter states that matter is made up of a large number of tiny, tiny means very, very small, okay, of tiny and discrete particles. Uh. Usually, students will ask, uh, what's the meanings of discrete? What's the meanings of discrete? So can any of you tell me what's the meanings of discrete? Small? No. Tiny is small, okay? Tiny means very small. Okay, tiny means very small. But how about discrete? Berasingan, yes. Okay, berasingan uh, means separated, not continuous, uh, separated. Okay, or berasingan. Okay, yes, that's good. So means, uh, means what? Let's see these examples. Let's say we have a piece of gold. And then some, if we see this piece of gold uh, with our naked eye, you will find that actually so this is just one piece of gold, right? And then so from this point to another point, they are continuous. They are not separated, just one, not separated. But if you use a good microscope, the electron microscope to observe this, uh, you will get something like this. Okay. And then you can see that inside this gold, there are billion million and or billions of small particles eh? and these particles they are not continuous they are separated okay they are not joined together they are very close to each other but they are not joined together they are separated and we call this atom uh, that is what uh this are particle theories of matter about okay you say anything in this world uh the matters all the metals in this world are made up of this small uh, very very small particles and these particles they are separated and not connected eh? they are discrete so this is particle theories of matter the diffusions in solid liquid and gas so what is diffusions eh? what is diffusions diffusion is a process resulting from random motions of molecules by which there is a net flows of matter from a uh, regions of high concentration to a uh, regions of low concentrations in SPM, you need to memorize these definitions because in exam, they will ask you uh, what's the definition for diffusions. And uh, diffusion is a physical process, uh, but not a chemical process. It means it's not chemical reactions. And then diffusions can occur in solid liquids and gas. And then the rate of diffusion, the rate of diffusion means how fast the diffusions occur. Uh. The diffusions occurs. Okay, so the rate of diffusion is highest in gas, means that it's fastest in gas and uh, lowest in solids, means that it's the slowest in solid.